Good evening. Um, I'm doing a demonstration of my uh, Suzuki build number 14 and um, I'll give a run through of the different elements of this Suzuki and then let you hear it. Um, I tried something different on this one. But uh, basically, I'll, I'll tell you the woods. This is this is all elm, elm body, uh, mahogany one piece neck. We have a shisham veneer on the back, a yew veneer on the front, with my signature engraved in. I've got ash three tuners, uh, East Indian rosewood fretboard. Maple bindings, holly pick guard, um, East Indian rosewood bridge, bone, nut, and saddle, homemade brass tailpiece. Um, the difference with this one is the construction. Uh, normally, I've done a, a large X brace, a large V brace with a strong cross member here or an X brace uh, but this time I wanted to uh, try and make this is only my own imagination so I mean you may not agree with it you can let me know in the comments in a nice kind way what you think um, but I wanted the sound ball to be as resonant as possible and uh, with, uh, uh, without having with having no uh, sound hole in the front just a side port that allow more area of the sound ball to be effective in my view. So I made a strong narrow V brace which runs from the uh, tail um, block up to about this area. There's a short cross member just connecting it right under the bridge. Kept the bridge short so it doesn't extend further than the V brace. Uh, I put a perimeter route all the way around to on the inside to allow more vibration in, in my humble imagination. I uh, don't know whether this works. And um, I have small finger braces not attached to the V brace, just independently radiating out in this fashion from the bridge area. Um, so that's what I've done in order to try and get louder, uh, more powerful volume, better tone, or, and, and uh, this is what it sounds like now. It's not been set up, I've just literally just made the nut and the bridge and put the strings on. I haven't done any fret leaven or anything, um, but uh, it's not too bad in terms of action height. And it sounds like this. One twangy string at the top there, which is to do with, you know, you have to uh, correct some thing with the uh, angle of uh, it's going over the saddle or whatever. something similar in terms of the, uh, the bracing design. Um, I'll, I'll, if I haven't put some pictures up, I think I did put some pictures on my page of the bracing before I glued this all together so you can have a look, look at that. But that's Suzuki number 14. Thank you for watching.